complete training is available on ITDVDs.com. Now let's begin the training. In this tutorial we're going to talk about VMware vMotion, VMware HA or High Availability, and VMware DRS. These are all great tools that are a part of VMware infrastructure and in particular Virtual Center. Now in this tutorial we assume that you have a pretty good working knowledge of ESX server and Virtual Center. If you don't, there's another tutorial on ITDVDs.com called ESX3 and Virtual Center 2 Administration. So start there if you don't have a familiarity with uh, ESX and Virtual Center. If you do and you want to learn more about vMotion, DRS, and HA, this is a tutorial for you. vMotion is part of Virtual Center and it has to be licensed uh, and we're going to go over that later but what it is is it allows you to move a running virtual machine from one ESX host to another ESX host without shutting it down so zero downtime and you can move from one host to another it's pretty amazing the other one is VMware HA and what this is is if one of your hosts dies one of your ESX hosts HA makes it so that the virtual machine will automatically be started up on another host. So that's HA. DRS. DRS allows you to dynamically allocate your virtual machines to your different hosts. So let's say you have three ESX hosts in your cluster, and we're going to go over clusters later and one of your ESX hosts is really over utilized it's using a lot of memory a lot of processor well DRS will automatically move that server over to an underutilized ESX host so it'll juggle your virtual machines around on all your servers in your cluster so that the resources are evenly balanced and you don't have one ESX host struggling while another one's just sitting there pretty much idle and it can do this all automatically it can do it manually so that it'll make suggestions but you have to initiate the move if you'd like so there are a number of different options we're going to go over and these are all really really great tools that we can use but we do have to have specific hardware in order to use them so that's what we're going to talk about next